Okay, so here we have the concrete method for multiplication. We've got 174 times 3, so we've, we've got 174 laid out in the hundreds, tens and ones three times. If we look at the, start with the ones column again, we've got three groups of four, which makes 12. So we're going to regroup 10 ones into a 10. And that leaves us with two ones. And looking at the tens column, we've got um, 22 tens because uh, we've got seven, uh, three sets of seven, which is going to make 21, and one more 10. So we need to regroup 20 of the tens into hundreds. We're going to put two extra hundreds into the hundreds column. And we've got two tens in the tens column. And now we've got five hundreds. So 174 multiplied by 3 makes 522. Here we have 174 times by 3 laid out in the pictorial and the abstract. And once again, like all of the other um, calculations, it's really important that children see um, how the pictorial links to the abstract because the aim is to move them onto the abstract as soon as they're ready. Um, so looking at the ones column, we've got um, four sets of three, uh, which is 12. So we're regrouping 10 ones into the tens column. When we look at the abstract, 4 times 3 is 12. So we put the tens above the tens column. <clears throat> now looking at the tens column, we have um, 3 sets of 7 and 1 more which makes 22. So again, we're regrouping, regrouping one 10 to make 100. Another 10 to make 100. And then on the uh, there's, there's two tens left over on the pictorial. 7 times 3 is 21, plus one more 10 makes 22. Um, so we'll do the 5, not forgetting to regroup the 200s on the abstract. Uh, 3 times 1 is 3, plus 2 makes 5. So once we ha again, we have the answer 522.